Today we were excited to host the first STEM fair uh, where we had all of the fourth grade students in Waterford come and visit us um, here at Mott High School. Um, in our first year of the STEM program, our students, both from Kettering and Mott, were ex excited to uh, put together a presentation uh, and an activity for the younger kids that demonstrated something that they had learned. Uh, and I enjoyed working on this year. They just told us that we're going to teach fourth graders and we had to find the subject and find out all about it. So today I taught the kids circuits about how they work and how they operate and how they also are in everyday life. Um, I, we made an operation game to signify how it's like in all this type of different stuff. It took us a lot of actual work to find out how to simplify it down to a fourth grader's knowledge. And we uh, did a balloon kebab, which is sticking a needle or skewer through a balloon without it popping. And we had to teach the fourth graders about the molecules and how the molecules are more spread out and that's why the balloon doesn't pop. I, I ran the, the ping pong cannon, the one that everybody was getting scared by. We had a station all about the shape and size of bubbles and another one about static electricity and um, a lot of other fun stuff. Magnets, how do magnets work? So my station was about velocity. I was teaching the kids about how fast a car goes, how, long, how to find it, how long it takes the car to get down, and how long the ramp is. Today I ran a station about uh, potential kinetic energy. So what we did, we just had a uh, we had the kids build their own track, and we try to get them to land, land a, uh, a harvest car on the paper plate. And like before they uh, they set off their cars, we would ask them where where they see the potential kinetic energy in their track. Well, we instructed static electricity, and you know how it works with positive and negative charges. We finally get to like finish our independent projects and be able to show little kids and maybe and like bring them into like the engineering field. I saw a lot of smiling little faces and our kids uh, really kind of stepped up to the plate and uh, did a good job teaching the younger kids.